And if I was to describe it very briefly, it's like the ultimate concept model software. I didn't mean to go that far back. Okay, ladies and gents, welcome back to a brand new video. Just before we dive into the video, can you please smash that thumbs button and subscribe? That'd be much, much appreciated. So yes, I get asked the following questions a lot. I get asked a lot of questions about softwares. What softwares do I use? What have I used in the past? What types of softwares do I use for rendering, for creating my floor plans, etc.? And I've made a previous video that dives into this, diving into the BIM softwares, 3D modeling softwares, rendering programs, etc. So make sure you check out that video. However, today I'm going to dive a little bit deeper into a specific software called Snaptrude. online software that doesn't require you to download anything and uses the cloud as storage. This means that as long as you have access to the internet, you have access to Snaptrude. And this means that if your computer or your laptop isn't powerful enough to run other softwares or you don't have enough storage, this won't matter because Snaptrude uses the cloud as storage. And you can also use it for your tablet, your phone. Um, so if you just wanted to sit and watch a film and start doing some modeling on your iPad, you can do that. And it's perfect. It's been designed to tailor towards architecture students, architects, interior architects, and the real estate industry. It offers a lot of features which I think are really useful, and some are actually quite unique for a software. It has real-time collaboration, BIM integration, parametric design, smart labels, smart stories, smart spaces, site data, furniture library, and the list goes on. They've got a lot of features which I think are great for you fellow architecture students. And if I was to describe it very briefly, it's like the ultimate concept model software. And it's a mix between SketchUp and Revit. So to actually dive into the software itself, I'm going to look at four key features of Snaptrude. The four key features that I'm going to be picking out today are create buildings from massing, create a sketch, collaboration, and labeling. So if we dive into the software itself, it's super easy to sign up. You literally just throw in your email, um, set up a password, etc and it's free for the first three projects that you work on. And then once you're on this page, you just do create a project, select your project name, I'm just gonna go test, and then you can go your units, uh, millimeters, centimeters, meters, etc. I'm just gonna roll with millimeters because usually um, when you're producing drawings, etc. in practice, you normally work with millimeters. So if we create, we've got a little loading page, and then boom, we're in. So as you can see, it looks fairly similar to SketchUp, I'd say. And you've got all of your tools along the top. You've got these tools down the right, tools along the bottom. And then these are actually to show the stories of your building. And it's super, super simple. It's really easy to pick up. If you've used SketchUp in the past or any other software in the past, you'll pick this up really, really quickly because it's so easy to use. And also, if you haven't used any softwares at all, it's super easy to pick up as well. So along the top here, you've got your drawing points all of these you've got your draw circle line push pull um, copy array import you can import sketches um, CAD topography you've got your measuring tools you've got your views already set up so you can just click through them and then you've got an automate button which is the thing I think is really really unique about this software so if I was just to do um, some random drawing let's just click the draw button and this just basically draws um, some walls for you so you can type in exactly the dimensions that you want um, and it's obviously got the snapping tool and there you go you've got a mass so it produces a mass straight away when you are um, drawing you can select it um, and whatnot and then you can say for example if you wanted to copy this mass click the corner copy it there you could then copy that one up to there massive overhang here <laughs> not like this would be possible and then on push pull because you have basically copied and pasted so therefore whatever you do to one of them it's going to do it throughout so you could push pull there you could push pull there you could push pull there and at different angles and because of the parametric design it's going to follow all of the other masses that you've copied and pasted so as you can see i'm just trying to create some kind of massing model to show some kind of building um, and i'm going to show you the tools that this software has which i think is pretty cool so at the top here once you've got this kind of form whatever it is if you're doing some kind of massing etc and if you want to do some quick massing drawings or some quick um, designs of or iterations of your building if you go over to automate you can click this create drawing create building auto interior or auto dimensions so if you do create building it will create walls for you or create ceilings and roofs for you it will create a floor slab for you and as you can see here from a click of the button i've got 
walls which I can delete and I've got interior spaces um, and I can then go into import I can then go into draw I can go and push pull I can select this corner here and I could drag it out and I can change certain elements just by clicking push and pull so if we wanted this roof to come up here we wanted this roof to come up like that the next feature which i think is great is creating a building from a sketch so you can simply use a sketch like this click the spaces and it will turn it into rooms and that is a really quick and easy way if you guys have done a sketch floor plan and you just want to produce some kind of massing out of that scan it in or take a picture of it upload it to snaptrude click the rooms and there you go you've got massing straight away you can push and pull them you can stretch them you can start labeling them and therefore you can turn a drawing into a 3d massing model within seconds literally within a snap of your fingers pardon the pun <laughs> god that was bad then another really cool feature is smart labeling so if i wanted to turn this into a decking um you can just double click into it you can type in deck and it will turn that specific model or that model that you've you've duplicated into a decking and it will apply the material to it which is absolutely insane if i wanted this to be um, a water body for example double click into it turn into water body and it will turn it into water <laughs> and you can also export these models straight into rhino revit or sketchup or anything like that you can export it to dwg um, which is actually really useful to take this model straight into a different software and begin to add more detail and add more depth into it and the final feature that i want to share with you guys is the collaboration tool which you can go over to here you can click the export slash share button click share model uh, send an invite to someone who has got a SnapTrude account and they can simply come in and just join in with the model and start editing things and make comments and those kinds of things. So if you were to model with someone at university, they can very easily come in and make their own changes. Or if you wanted to show a client and they wanted to make some adjustments or anything like that, it's really, really quick and easy to do. And although you've just seen me clicking and making some random model, you can actually produce some amazing stuff in this software. And here is an existing model that has been produced previously, uh, which I think is absolutely crazy. So you can add all the textures, materials, and obviously they've got their library where you can add all the furniture, you can add trees in. Um, and here's here's something that you could do out of SnapTrue. So this is just a really simple master model that they've turned into a building simply by clicking the create building tab. It looks like a great starting point to export into something like Rhino or Revit start adding some more detail here is a housing model where you can see uh, where they've added materials and also when they dive into the space itself you can see all of the furniture you can see they've added windows balustrades um, doors staircases the whole lot um, and i think it actually looks really good and detailed and if you guys want to check out SnapTrude for yourself head over to the website or click the link down below in the description which will send you straight to the website sign up for free um, using any email and then you can start collaborating and designing with your friends and that is going to be a wrap on today's video thank you snaptree for sponsoring today's video make sure you smash the thunder button make sure to subscribe hit the notification bell and i'll see you next time Peace.